Ennis Melham and my store is in Edmonton, Alberta, Canada. As a result, I just saw an opportunity and I thought it's time to jump on it. I love working in restaurants. I have a long history of it. Since COVID started, I really got into smoking meats, smoking briskets, and it just kind of seemed like a natural transition for me to get into something that has a lot of growth potential and uh, seems like a great place to, you know, great company to, uh, to be part of. Yeah, I'd actually uh, probably made a few hundred myself. Had a few, uh, I've had a few cookouts, let's just say, <laughs> over the last few years. Yeah, I did some catering work uh, with brisket and barbecue as well. So, like, a lot of it just seemed like it just aligned, right? So, for me, it kind of seemed like a natural transition. So, I'm hoping for the best as soon as we open. As for Barbecue University, it's been what I expected it to be in that uh, we are learning a lot about cooking, temperatures, uh, how, to, how to run a restaurant, not just how to work at a restaurant. Uh, I like that there's the emphasis on the business side that you're not going to get working somewhere because you're not managing or you're not, you know, you're not owning. Uh, so they, they really give us the mindset here of, you know, this is your business, build your business on leadership that they give us, that you have a crew and you're supposed to lead them forward, get out there into the public, meet people, talk to them, get them excited about Dickies, get them excited about barbecue and get them excited about you you know, as, a, as an owner and that they build a relationship with people so that they come ask for you by name and you build that sort of community spirit. I think that's how this company was launched. That's how it grew. And that's a formula for success. Honestly, I am looking forward to the store opening. Uh, I've had a little bit of snags in construction and I'm sure that's a, a common experience for a lot of new stores. But uh, as soon as it's up and running, I think we're planning to open in the spring. So it's like right at the very beginning of barbecue season. I guess that's what I'm looking forward to the most, right? When we're open and there's that first rush of people that are coming in and, you know, kind of feeling like, okay, you know what? I, I did something, I did something good. Maybe, maybe what I'll say is I'm excited about the challenge. Uh, we're calling it Pit Smoked. And uh, the, the reason for that is uh, when we were here at Central, the very first uh, Dickies location, uh, they have a fantastic, huge pit, and uh, everything that came out of it just tasted amazing. So uh, it was just, this is real pit smoked, and that was what clicked in my head. So I was like, okay, let's try to replicate that as much as possible. Mm -hmm.